everyone, welcome to my three step formula to learn any musical piece. Step number one, learn your skeleton. What is a skeleton? A skeleton is the bare bone melody performed in a rhythmically correct way. And I must stress the latter part of the sentence, performed in a rhythmically correct way. Okay, so um, basically you need to make sure that the beats are where they are meant to go because rhythm is master supreme in these matters <laughs> and we must obey him. So um, how does uh, a skeleton look like? So if I am to learn it will look like this. Basically it's bare melody, no additions, no ornamentation techniques. It will look like this. So see, there's. I just know where my notes are on the kanun, um, and then basically I'm just alternating right and left, and I'm performing everything in a rhythmically correct way on the beat. So this is your first step. Step number two is to, if you haven't done so already, to start to build um, your bank of ornamentation techniques depending on where you are on the canoe success path. If you don't know what a canoe success path is, I'll link to it. To the, it's a five stage path that helps you learn kanun where you have to worry about the very few things that matter to that stage and forget everything else. So, um, let me know what stage you are at, by the way. So, say you are stage three, okay? Um, then you would have five ornamentation techniques. So, now that I have mastered my, my skeleton, uh, I am going to be working on my ornamentation techniques away from the piece, okay? Um, and to see how that works, I'm going to link to my fundamentals of practice um, video where I show you what to do with these ornamentation techniques. Uh, it goes into further explanation. You're basically going to practice them in a scale. So say I want to work on my zigzag. In my academy, um, I borrow names of existing names of ornamentation techniques from Western music, for instance, legato, tremolo. They are all Italian and, and Latin, um, mostly Italian. So, uh, but then if there are no names, then I make up my own names. So this ornamentation technique is called zigzag. It's named after yours truly. Uh, not after. Bye. <laughs> so it's basically it's just it because if you are to connect the dots between uh, the movement of the kanon, it will make a zigzag line. That's that's my thinking. I'm I'm a visual person. So I am going to practice my zigzag in a scale. <laughs> then I'm going to implement it within the piece which is step number three so away from the piece I'm going to work on my ornamentation technique and then now it's time for me to look at places where I can insert the zigzag within so let's look at how that might might look like can look at adding different ornamentation techniques like grace notes. I added two, uh, which is tremolo and gruppetto. Gruppetto is da -da -da -da. Here's exact. So that is stage number three. Basically, I am implementing the ornamentation techniques within the piece. So, um, and this formula works for any piece of music, regardless of, of how simple or complex. Number one, you learn the skeleton, which is the bare bone melody performed in a rhythmically correct way. Number two, you work on your ornamentation techniques away from the piece 
during the warm-up section of your practice and then number three you add the ornamentation techniques that um, you have worked on within the piece I also must say do not try to use ornamentation techniques outside or beyond your uh, stage of the Hanu success path it's not gonna work <laughs> um, just work with your existing bank of ornamentation techniques sometimes it helps for my students to have a list of ornamentation techniques in front of them so they can think oh okay I can add this here or I can add this there um, obviously the more you do this the less you need um, the less you know just um, you know uh, thinking that you need it becomes a second nature so I hope this is helpful uh, let me know how this uh, three-step formula to learning any piece serves you and I'll see you in the next video make sure you subscribe